Hey guys, Davison here. So do you have a case of the royal baby fever? Because sometime today or tomorrow, Kate Middleton is supposed to give birth to the royal baby. She went into labor officially late last night, or I guess you could say yesterday, and it was announced by the palace. The specific details are that the Duchess traveled by car from Kensington Palace to the Linda Wing at St. Mary's Hospital with the Duke of Cambridge at 2.38 a.m. this morning. I don't know if that's uh, Eastern time or whatever, but um, I, I think the baby should be called Wait because everyone's waiting for it, so William and Kate mixed together, Wait. <laughs> Most people think the baby's either going to be named Diana or Alexandra or, you know, other traditional kind of names. Uh, I have no idea. If it's a girl, that, that is. Um, I really want the baby to be named Canada. I've said this multiple times. Prince or Princess Canada. Isn't that great? It's perfect. But unfortunately, that's unlikely to happen as well. But, uh, yeah, why do we even care about this? Like, I care only because it's something to talk about, right? Something to get excited about and like wait for everyone loves anticipation you know that's what we live for the future the promises of the future the drama you know and they, that's why people watch sports tournaments and and the olympic games it's not it's not the actual process so much as the the anticipation for the outcome, which in this case is a baby emerging from Kate's vajayjay. Vajayjay. I did it. No one gave a shit when I gave birth. <laughs> Whatever. We'll see. I'll vlog again when the damn thing is born. Congratulations, Will and Kate, on your new baby, Wait Canada the First.